Hey, welcome to class. Thanks for being on time. I appreciate it. Okay, so let me tell you, the word today that we're teaching you is about bisque. You ever heard of tomato bisque or lobster bisque soup? Uh, very delicious. Somebody asked me, what's the difference between tomato bisque and uh, cream of tomato? And I had to do some research. The difference is this, crustaceans. Well, we're probably going to teach you two words today. If you don't know what crustaceans are, crustaceans are seafood with the shell. And uh, bis comes from the French word uh, bees quits. And uh, I hope I pronounced it correctly. Please forgive me if I didn't. But uh, that term in, in English, translated in English, means twice cooked. So here's how it goes. They take the crustaceans and they boil it and they create a broth out of it first. That's the first time cooking it. Then usually like the lobster bisque, they'll take the meat out of it and then they'll make a bisque with the, this flavorful broth that they've created. So it's twice cooked. It's cooked to make the broth and then the meat's taken out of the shell and it's used in the soup. Tomato bisque has a crustacean flavoring. So if you can't have shellfish, I do not advise you eating a true tomato bisque. And you could always ask the restaurant if it's a true tomato bisque if it includes broth from crustaceans. So there you go. Enjoy tomato bisque if you don't have allergies. It's amazing, it's thick, it's creamy, it's delicious. Uh, cream of tomato just is made with heavy cream. You guys take care. That's the lesson for today.